Greetings, fellow traveler. Today, I want to remind you of the power of your creativity. Not simply exploring your imagination, but your ability to truly create something meaningful out of the most mundane of things. I remind you of this today because I came across a moment in my journey where I saw this kid talking about a video game they were playing. And they said they understand how to play the game, but to make the game more interesting, they create a story around it as if they are the character in the game and they have a particular mission, not related to the game, but it's related to them and what they would like to happen in their life. And that allowed them to push through and get to the points that they wanted to in the game. Now, as small as that is, especially seeing this story being told by a kid, it helped me understand myself and the role that I play in my life. It's an understanding of no matter what I do, no matter what I have done, what I'm doing now, what I will do in the future, the meaning that comes from those things are derived from the story that I place around it. It's the same for me as it is for anybody else. We can have ups, we can have downs. We can have lucky times, we can have unlucky times. We can label things good or bad, it doesn't matter. But what I realized in listening to that child speak of their experience was reminding myself of the wisdom that kids reveal to us at times because they're not bound by the ideas that adults have a lot of times in life. So this is a reminder to step into your creative aspect. Step into the exploration of your imagination. Understand what you're experiencing in your moments along your journey. And don't be fearful in expressing those things. Don't be fearful in exploring the emotions or even the outcomes that are presenting themselves to you on your journey. Don't get so caught up in critiquing them. Don't say, oh, this is bad for me or this is good for me. Look at the outcome that you truthfully wanted when you did or when you said certain things, when you maneuvered a certain way along your journey. And if that's the outcome that you wanted, then give all praise. If not, then understand where the course correction can be applied. But move forward. Because even when the outcomes are not what we expect, it's still an expression. It's the end result of an expression that we have placed out into this world. So know that that is your creative power in any and everything you do. I say and I remind myself a majority of time that I'm not perfect because it's a reminder to give myself grace and still allow myself the freedom to be creative, to express who I am. It doesn't matter how many people receive because it's all about my self-expression and understanding who I am more. So even when I witness others going through their journey, expressing their perspectives of life, I don't take it personally. I'm inspired because I see somebody that's willing to go into the darkness that this life can present and they're shining a light on these areas. See, that's been helpful for myself, but I see how it's been helpful for others as they go along their journey, whether they know it or not, they've helped a stranger like myself. That's a beautiful thing. So hopefully and even sharing some of these thoughts and ideas with you all, maybe just one person understands it a little bit better than me. Maybe one person understands in a way that helps progress me along my journey. But no matter what, I'm grateful because I see that it's nothing but expression. It's all the creative power within us. So this is a reminder today to step into your power. Know that it's not about judging the outcome. It's simply about being involved in the creative process and understanding that no matter what happens, at least you took a step forward. I think that's a good place to leave it for now. Until next time, be blessed. And please, don't forget to smile.